<laughs> hey, yeah. Hey, we. <laughs> hey, we. <laughs> It's like we stars here. How are you all doing? This is normal, normal content. I told you all I would be the most masochistic VTuber in the world. I told you. Who else is making beat me up list? Oh yeah, I didn't even introduce the video. Today, we're, we're, I made a beat me up list. All the characters that I want to beat me up is on this list. Every single character other than VTubers that I've wanted to beat me up is on this list. The only characters that aren't on here is VTubers because I feel like VTubers are an entirely different thing and plus you already know which VTubers I want to beat me up. <clears throat> the Shoujo Hall Alive, but nothing. And Wespin Miko. Well, I mean, I mean, said nothing. I said nothing. I made a whole list. This took me like hours to make. <laughs> Um, disclaimer, it's for fun, these characters are purely fictional, so I'm just letting you guys know, I'm a horny masochist, boom. Alright, you guys ready? The first character, you already know, <laughs> Korra is a badass, okay? Like, I've, I, if Korra choked me with her thighs, I would be the first in line, okay? I would be the first in line to be there. I would run, I would run faster than the speed of light! I will fucking jump out my window! My freaking window! Just for Kura to fuck me up. I will be first in line. Her muscles, oh, it's... It's like sucking on the fingers, dude. It's like, oh, it's so good. Okay, I just want her to punch me, kick me, slap me, choke me, freaking knee me in the stomach until I throw up. All of it. Let's freaking go! <laughs> you already know. And you already know, it's Monica from Doki Doki Literature Club. You already know. The reason why I really love Monica, okay? She's athletic. She can fuck me up. She can outrun me. I know in the, in the Doki Doki Literature Club lore, Mo Monica's like a runner. That made me even more want to get beat up by her. Imagine her beating me up at like super fast speeds. Like fucking like super saiyan. Just... <laughs> Just all up in my face. And then she chases me down and freaking tackles me and it gets freaking lewd from there. I'm not gonna say because I'll probably get demonetized. I'm just kidding. I don't even make money from, from these videos. So I'm just gonna say it. She would fuck me. Okay. <laughs> okay, next character. You already know. <laughs> you already know. Sayori. I like Sayori. I feel like Sayori would beat me up too. Look at look, look at that stare. Look at that stare. How can you deny the Sayori stare? Could you freaking imagine? She's like Yari Yari days and then just pits me in a daze. <laughs> you already know. Yuri. Yes, yes, and yes, and yes, because yes. <laughs> That's all you need to know, okay? Like, Yuri, okay, first of all, she has that Dami Mommy look, okay? Like, you already know she's on the list, okay? I want her to choke me for thighs. <laughs> and she's a Yandere, which makes it all the more better. And she looks like that type that would just completely, like, I just want her to yell at me. <laughs> I just want her to yell at me. Just make me feel like scum. Just call me a bitch. Call me pathetic. Just a bunch of times, like 10 million times. Just call me pathetic. Just punch me, kick me, then slap me for good measure. And then probably just slap me with like a fly swatter. Just because. <laughs> and then say, you're like a fly. And then slap me with a fly swatter. That's all I want, okay? And plus, I just think Yuri has it. Yuri has an intimidating factor to her, which makes it all the more better. <laughs> I already know who it is. Natsuki! Yes! I made a whole animation of her beating me up already because that's how awesome she is. She's Tsundere, which makes it all the more better. She's aggressive. She would make me cry as I'm eating whipped cream or something. <laughs> that made no sense, but we're gonna go with it. I feel like I want you. She's almost like Yuri in the sense to where she would intimidate me. Like, I just want to be intimidated by the one I love. Is that too much to ask? She would just mess me up, okay? I want her to just capture me. I want Natsuki, actually. I would love for her to just to capture me and just and just and just mess me up. Just completely beat me up. Just just throw me like a like a like a, <laughs> like a toaster strudel across the room. That's all I need in my life, okay? Wonder Woman, yes. Okay, I never even told you guys I like this character, but Wonder Woman? Ah oh, yes, please step on me, please. <laughs> I'm so sorry, mommy. Sorry, mommy? Sorry. Mommy? So sorry. Mommy? So, so, so sorry. Sorry. Mommy? 
I feel like Wonder Woman would just mess me up, and she probably would. So I think that that's why she's on the list. Okay, Wonder Woman, dude, favorite superhero mainly because I feel like she would mess me up. And I would be like, oh, Wonder Woman, come and punch me and kick me down. I'll be like, oh, oh. And dude, don't get me started on Wonder Woman's lasso. Okay, so her personality, I feel like her personality would be perfect too because she would be like all powerful and shit. She would like pit me in my place immediately and then her fucking lasso, oh my god. Could you imagine the amount of pain that could come from that? She could just lasso me and just punch me as I'm tied up. Like she could freaking swing me to the ground multiple times like I fucking she could just she could just grab her lasso, tie me up, and just swing me to the ground repeatedly as I'm like, oh, 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 oh. freaking Adora from she <laughs> Don't look at that GIF right there. I didn't. I I I I I, I don't, don't, fuck. You already know. Just just punch me. Just take me down a peg. That's all I need. Okay. Just grab your sword or fist. <laughs> <laughs> grab your fist. Just grab your fist. Just don't forget your fist when you punch me, okay? Just make sure you grab your fist and just punch me, alright? I know what you all are probably gonna say. I am a little bit of a furry. A little bit. Not fully, a little bit. Because <laughs> I do like some furry characters. I- She- Katra is just- Duh! Oh, look at her! How can you not? Are, are you all hearing that right now? God damn it. I'm trying to make a horny video. I'm trying to make a horny video. There's a lawnmower outside my house. I mean the attic. There's like a lawnmower outside of the attic. Ugh. It's probably, it's probably, it's probably Project Melody mowing the grass. Melody! Melody! It won't stop! <laughs> the lawnmower won't stop! Do you hear this? <laughs> it's so loud! Lawnmower ASMR. Let's go! Lawnmower. <laughs> Lawnmower ASMR. Okay, um, it's a little bit farther away now, so we're gonna continue the video. Sorry about that, guys. You know, lawnmower ASMR, it just happens every once in a while. Dude, we should actually make that a video. Can we do like lawnmower ASMR? I can ask Melody if she can mow the grass again and if we can get ASMR. One second. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I mean, I am trapped in V Sojo's attic. I can just, I can just talk to them and be like, hey, let's have some lawnmower ASMR. <laughs> Anyways, where were we? Oh yeah. I want Katra to step on me! <laughs> I want Katra just to look at me like, I, like I'm scum, okay? For, that's step one. Step two, step on me. Step three, step on me. And step four, most importantly, spit on me, then step on me. <laughs> if that, that would be me and Katra. That would be me and her relationship. Every day, I just... <laughs> I just wake up in the morning. <laughs> I wake up in the morning. <laughs> The first thing I see is Katra over my face, just with that smirk and just punches me. <laughs> Every day, just <laughs> I go to the bathroom, I come out the shower, <laughs> I walk to the store, <laughs> she just comes and punches me every single minute of every single day of every single thing that I do in my life. She will be there to punch me, and that's me and Katra's relationship, okay? Glimmer! Glimmer, one of my top free, one of my top favorites. I want Glimmer to mess me up every single second of every single day, every millisecond. I want no millisecond wasted when Glimmer beats me the fuck up, okay? <laughs> I want every millisecond to be used with her, with her fist to my face and just giving me like complete knuckle sandwiches. When I ask what's for dinner tonight, I want Glimmer to respond knuckle sandwiches. <laughs> I love this video. This is one of my favorite videos I made this year. <laughs> At the end of the day, when I ask to go to sleep, I'm gonna ask Glimmer if she can just help me go to sleep. And the way she does that is gonna be ch choking me with her thighs. That's how I sleep every night, by Glimmer's thighs over on my neck. That's it. Anyways, next. <laughs> Jinx. Jinx, okay, top tier. I love the way she looks. She gives us that, that, that rebellious look. I, like, Jinx is that type of girl where if, if you're drinking water, she will karate chop and punch your water in your face. <laughs> I just want Jinx to shove the water bottle down my throat and just make me just swallow the water. <laughs> Vi is amazing. Okay, I'm gonna say this. When I saw Vi, I... 
No, when I saw Vi, I was head over heels. I was drooling on the floor. I was on my knees. I'm like, oh, Vi. Oh, heavenly Vi. Oh, Vi, please punch me. <laughs> please make me your bottom bitch. Oh, Vi. Oh, Vi. <laughs> Caitlin, dude. Excuse me? Mommy? Sorry? Mommy? Sorry. Mommy? Sorry. Mommy? Like, that's her. That's literally Caitlyn. <laughs> if I could lucid dream, she would shoot me down, knock me out, bring me to her house, and I would just wake up to seeing her calling me pathetic and just beating me the F up. That's it. It would just be this all night. <laughs> Marion from Muscle River City Girls? Her muscles, dude. Every time I see someone with muscles, it makes me just want to faint, dude. <laughs> Could you imagine? I just walk down the street, I see someone that has muscles, I just faint <laughs> right in front of them. And you're like, oh my god. <laughs> if I saw Murian in her muscles and she flexed, I would faint right there on the spot. I'd just be like, no, oh, I'd just faint. And if she punched me, I'd be done. <laughs> I'd be knocked out for the whole day. <laughs> All right, more River City Girls. This is Misako. She, yes, I would want her to beat me up. Um, number one, why? Because her personality is amazing and her design is also amazing. She would just be a very aggressive and I love aggressive characters. I, I have a thing for aggressive characters. I don't know why, but I just do. I want her to make me the cream cheese for her bagel. That's all I want, okay? Next one. Kyoko, I, I, yeah, I like Kyoko. I feel like Kyoko is like energetic and she would just be like, <laughs> like all over me <laughs> this would be me right there and that's kyoko it would just be this exactly <laughs> just fuck here let me move out the way so you can see the word hold let me move out the way fuck exactly that's all i want <laughs> that that that, clar that clarifies it all just fuck fuck me up and both sexually and physically and mentally and spiritually <laughs> <laughs> that, 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 that one picture determines this whole entire fantasy I have with Mermista from She-Ra. Just, just fuck. Fuck. And always. <laughs> just fuck. Exactly. Okay, next one. <laughs> Oda-chan. <laughs> that fucking meme. But yes, Oda-chan. <laughs> There's a reason why I watch um, Oda-chan a lot. She, she just has that personality that works. She would like force me like to drink soda and then she would make me throw up the soda by punching me in the stomach to throw up the soda. <laughs> she would force me to drink milkshakes and then she would like kick me in the face to make me spit out the milkshake after I was about to drink it. That's Oda-chan. That's why I love her. That's why I want Oda trying to beat me up. Oh yeah, Cam, listen, Cam is underrated as hell. Okay, her mask makes her hot as fuck. It gives her this mysterious look that makes it so good. Her eyes, dude, I don't know what's about these types of characters I love, but like she looks so emotionless that I just imagine like her just beating me up with that emotion emotionless look with the mask. Cause it gives her this type of like, it, gi it gives her this type of aesthetic. That I really love. Like this emotionless, like dead, like just emotionless dead, like I'm gonna punch you aesthetic. You know what I mean? Also, yeah, caught in 4K. <laughs> I know, listen, I know I'm caught in 4K. I know I'm caught in 4K. I always pit myself in 4K. I pit my whole life in 4K. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, let's go to the next one. <laughs> Mila from Dead or Alive 6. Dude, she's hot. Okay, like, come on. She gives off that tomboyish look. And I love tomboys. Tomboys are actually, like, my one of my favorites. Tomboys deserve a lot more love. Tomboys are really, very, 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 very hot. I will literally tick her off just so she can beat me up. I'll go in her house and I'll steal her laundry. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'll steal her laundry and I'll pour apple juice on her laundry. Then I'll give it back to her and be like, hey, beat me up. I just poured apple juice on your laundry. What are you going to do about it? <laughs> Hit Tommy. Same thing. I just, I would do the same thing. I'd probably go in her house and I would, I would steal from her cookie jar. And I'd just be like, I just stole your chocolate chip cookie, Hitami. What are you going to do? The reason why I really love Hitami though, I will say is because I love her clothes. 
and her strikes, they're, they're probably stronger than Myla's. Her, like, her, her name is literally Hit Tommy. Hit. Like, she will, so so strike like a, a hurricane. And my, I'd be just like this poor girl right here. Like, it, I find it funny how it's pink hair. It's literally just like me. Wow. See? You see what I mean? We're meant to be. We're meant to be. Look, see? This girl's pink hair. She's hitting the... She's she's punching her in the stomach. This girl's pink hair, just like me. See, it's meant to be. It's meant to be. That's a sign from the universe. Rachel, dude, listen. Look at Rachel. How can how can I not add her? I was literally debating on adding her, but dude, I'm like, how can I not? How can you look at this shit? Look at this shit. I'm pretty sure some of you may even love her. <laughs> I bet some of you may even love this bitch. Like. <laughs> How can you not add Rachel? Dude, she's literally like dummy mommy. Like all over. Look at dude, her suit is so badass. Oh yeah, I do love males and females. I mean, I never really told anyone that, but yeah, I'm I'm that type of person. So yeah, Ryu, dude, he's hot as fuck. I would I would love him to fuck me up. <laughs> yeah, I have a thing for ninjas. I don't know why, but ninjas, dude. I think it's because of the mask. I don't know. There's something I like about a mask and the mysteriousness and like it gives them like every because every character that I've seen that that has had a mask, they're like a badass. And I just to think of them as like the strong fighters that can just like mess someone up if they ever wanted to. And I think Ryu gives off that vibe, and I really love him for that. And his muscles, dude. Again, I would faint. I would. I, <laughs> I'm gonna. I see his muscles right now. I'm fainting. <sighs> I just want to be, I just, I want to be captured by him. Oh yeah, I never told anyone this. I have a thing for being captured too. I'm that type of person. All these characters, if they all captured me, I would be like head over heels for them. I, I'm into like Yandere stuff too, which that probably explains it. <laughs> I'm into being captured by like the, the ones I love. Oh God. Okay. Okay. L let me, let me just prepare myself and you guys before we go into the next one. I told you guys, yeah, I am sort of a, of like part furry. I just don't really have like a fursona and all of that. I do like furry care. I do like kind of like furry like characters if they're hot enough for me. So I'm just warning you before we get to the next to the next slide. Okay, you have that in mind. Okay, are you okay with that? Yeah. Okay. Next slide. <laughs> Aggressive Girl is one of my favorite shows. Fuck you if you don't like this, but dude, I want Red Skull to beat me up, okay? Dude, I should make like a fursona though. That'd be kind of cool. I, w I wanted like to make like a version of me, but like in a Gretzikos universe, I wanted to be like a rabbit. Like, I don't know why, I, I, I may do that. I may make, make that a video someday. Actually, yeah, I'll do that. I would love to like be my rabbit fursona and just have a Gretzigo beat me up. <laughs> I just want Gretzigo just fuck me up, okay? Like, dude, she really has nunchucks and she's literally like, I just want her to mess me up. I don't know what's about it. I don't know what it is. That's the crazy thing. I'm in, like, some, sometimes random things just bring out, like, some stuff in me. The nunchuck scene, I was like, I, I was like, oh my god. And I just fell to my knees and I was like, let's go. By my, um, by my own skin and blood and bones. Please hit me with those nunchucks. <laughs> Please replace those bottles with figures of me. And just beat me up with them. Fennecal, dude? Mm, yes, please. <laughs> Look, dude, she can t poles Look at this shit. She can fucking t poles How can you not love her? Ah! Yeah! I just want her to t poles over me, just asserting her dominance as after she, like, beats me up. I'm, like, on the ground, like, ah, no, Fennecal. She just t poses over me. That's all I need, okay? A t posing Fennecal over you? Best, best day of my life. Okay? Like, getting punched and kicked by Benefil? Even more of a best day of my life. Oh my god, they're mowing the Melody is mowing the lawn again. Melody! Melody, please! Fuck it, we're gonna end the video anyway. Alright okay, guys, thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. Links are in the description. I love you weekly to death. <laughs> I'm so sorry for the, for, the, for the mowing of the lawn. Um, I love you weekly to death, and don't forget to stay awesome!